Hello everybody, I am Dr. D. Kavita, Assistant Professor, Department of Biochemistry, Biotechnology and Bioinformatics of Nashingham Institute for Home Science and Higher Education for Women, Coimbatore, Tamil Nadu. Now we have chosen to study the module on Nature and Composition of Organic Acids. This module introduces the nature and composition of organic acids. Organic acids have been known for ages. Organic acids or organic compounds that possesses acidic properties. A carbon atom must exist in its structure and one of the most common organic acid is carboxylic acid which has the molecular formula RCOOH. These organic acids are the products of microbial metabolism. All organic acids occur naturally in a variety of vegetable and animal substrates and can therefore be either naturally present as constituents of foods as a result of normal biochemical metabolic processes, direct addition as acidulence, hydrolysis or bacterial growth or can later be added directly or indirectly to the products. After completing this module, you will be able to understand the nature of organic acids. You will understand the structure of various types of organic acids. You will be able to comprehend the application of organic acids in food preservation. First, let us see what are organic acids. Organic acids are commonly weak acids. Thus, they do not give up their protons, that's H plus, easily in solution. Organic acids are weak because they partially ionize in solution. In other words, they ionize when the bond between an oxygen and hydrogen atom breaks, releasing the hydrogen atom as H plus and forming a negatively charged acidic ion A minus. Organic acids are mostly soluble in organic solvents but cannot dissociate completely in water. Only low molecular weight organic acids such as formic acid and acetic acids are soluble in water and high molecular weight organic acids such as benzoic acids are not soluble in water. Organic acids have the common denominator of having carbon in their structure and although less reactive than inorganic acids, they are able to dissolve minerals in the mineral reserve in the soil. They differ from the fatty acids by the number of carbon atoms. Fatty acids have straight carbon even a number chains of 12 to 24 while organic acids have only 10 or even fewer carbon atoms. Organic acids can be used to manufacture a variety of products. If we look at our food industry, citric acid is a type of organic acid found in products such as sodas and canned tomatoes. Acetic acid is a very well known organic acid used to make vinegar. Let us move on to the classification of organic acids. There are two types of organic acids based on their existence. Pure acids namely lactic acid, propionic acid, acetic acid, citric acid and benzoic acid. The second buffered acids which include the calcium and sodium salts of propionic, acetic, citric and benzoic acid. These buffered organic acids are safer to handle and less causative to machinery. Most organic acids have an advantage because of their simple structure and small molecular size or mass which allows them to move freely throughout the cells. Organic acids also have many vital roles and functions in plants including contributing to growth and production of fruit and are therefore applied in many sectors of agriculture. Various organic acids or organic acid compounds are used as additives that are directly incorporated into human food. On the other hand, these acids are the products of fermentation. The structure of a few organic acids are given below. These are used as preservatives as well as acidulants, and even though organic acids are generally recognized as safe, that's abbreviated as GRAS, they also produce adverse sensory changes. Organic acids primarily include the saturated straight chain monocarboxylic acids. Derivatives of such organic acids may consist of unsaturated hydroxylic, phenolic and multicarboxylic acids. They are often referred as fatty acids, volatile fatty acids, weak acids or carboxylic acids. They can be classified according to the type of carbon atom either aliphatic, alicyclic, aromatic and heterocyclic. Second one being saturated or non-saturated. The third substituted or non-substituted. 
Fourth one, the number of functional groups, either mono, di or tricarboxylic acid. These short chain volatile organic acids with carbon numbers ranging from 2 to 12 significantly affect the flavor and quality of food. The lowest monocarboxylic aliphatic acids or rather volatile liquids with a distinct pungency whereas those acids containing more carbon atoms are of a relatively oily substance and slightly water soluble. In comparison, dicarboxylic acids or colorless solids with melting points at about 100 degrees centigrade. All these acids form somewhat soluble metal salts and esters suitable for gas chromatography and HPLC analysis. Many carboxylic acids are colorless liquids with disagreeable odors. Carboxylic acids exhibit strong hydrogen bonding between molecules. They therefore have high boiling points compared to other substances of comparable molar mass. The carboxyl group readily engages in hydrogen bonding with water molecules. The acids with 1 to 4 carbon atoms are completely miscible with water. Solubility decreases as the carbon chain length increases because dipole forces become less important and dispersion forces become more predominant. Now let us discuss the different types of organic acids. The simplest carboxylic acid called as formic acid that's HCOOH was first obtained by the distillation of ants. The bites of some ants inject formic acid and the stings of wasps and bees contain formic acid. The next higher homologue is acetic acid which is made by fermenting cedar and honey in the presence of oxygen. This fermentation produces vinegar a solution containing 4 to 10 percent acetic acid plus a number of other compounds that add to its flavor. Acetic acid is probably the most familiar weak acid. The third homologue, propionic acid, is seldom encountered in everyday life. The fourth homologue, butyric acid, is one of the most foul smelling substances. Therefore, most common organic acids used in food industry are citric acid, acetic acid, ascorbic acid, formic acid, benzoic acid, tartaric acid, lactic acid, etc. First, let us look into the important one that is the citric acid. Citric acid is a popular acidulant and due to its flexibility, it is used as effective preservative for foods. Salts of citric acid are, in fact, one of the most commonly used organic acids in the food, pharmaceutical industries and also in the metal processing and chemical industries. The chemical formula of citric acid is C6H8O7. The following diagram shows the structure of citric acid. Citric acid acts as a chelator and defined as a lipophobic dissociated acid inhibiting growth of microorganisms by chelating divalent metal ions from the medium. However, this has been found to be true more specifically in bacteria. Citric acid production synthesis by fermentation is the most economical and widely used way of obtaining this product. More than 90% of the citric acid produced in the world is obtained by fermentation which has its own advantages. That is operations are simple and stable. The plant is generally less complicated and needs less sophisticated control systems. Technical skills required are lower. Energy consumption is lower and frequent power failures do not critically affect the functioning of the plant. Citric acid plays an important role because of its pleasant taste, flavor enhancing characteristics and high solubility in spite of its fresh acidic flavor. The food industry is the largest consumer of citric acid estimated to use almost 70% of the total production. This is followed by the pharmaceutical industry about 12% with various other applications using the remaining 18% of the citric acid produced. Citric acid is the most important organic acid produced. Global production is estimated to be around 620-100 lakh metric tons per year and represents 60% of all food acidulants utilized worldwide. A large number of microorganisms including fungi and bacteria have been employed for citric acid production. Among the mentioned strains, the fungus Aspergillus niger has remained the organism of choice for commercial production because it produces more citric acid per unit time.
Citric acid can also be produced by chemical synthesis, although the cost is much higher than with fermentation. The disadvantage of using citric acid is due to its hygroscopic nature. It tends to cake when used in dry powders such as soft drink or beverage mixes and not always free flowing because of its uneven size. However, citric acid is the most commonly used food acidulant. Next is about the acetic acid. It is one of the oldest chemical known to humanity having GRAS status and used as a food additive and preservative. It is produced naturally during spoilage of fruit by acetic acid bacteria which is commonly found in foodstuffs, water and soil. Acetic acid is one of the main products of AAB metabolism and called as ethanoic acid or glacial acetic acid. It is known to be a stable substance and give a strong flavor profile and also increases the effectiveness of other flavor additives and substances present in food, particularly in bread. The structure of acetic acid is shown here. The chemical formula is CH3COOH. In order to achieve the same pH of organic acids with more than one COOH group, acetic acid should be used in higher concentrations which has only one COOH. It's a weak acid and cannot dissociate as completely as a strong acid. However, acetic acid is more inhibitory than lactic acid because of its higher pKa value. On the other hand, acetate is far less inhibitory to yeast than the more lipophilic sorbate, although they have the same pKa value. This may be due to the sorbate uh, is much higher capacity to dissolve in membrane. Acetic acid is lipid soluble and able to rapidly diffuse through the plasma membrane, a factor that has a dramatic effect on the pH of a cell. Intracellular acidification may, however, play a role in acids with short aliphatic chains, such as acetic acid and much higher concentrations are needed for growth inhibition. Next, let us look into as lactic acid. Lactic acid is an organic acid, again recognized as GRAS, used in foods as acidulants, flavoring agent, pH buffering agent and of course as a preservative with a wide range of industrial applications. It's also an hydroxy acid. It is not naturally present in foods but is produced during fermentation of foods by lactic acid bacteria. In developing countries where the world population increases, lactic acid fermentation is expected to become an important in preserving fresh vegetable, fruits and other food items for feeding humanity. Many fermented fruits and vegetable products namely sauerkraut, kimchi, gundrak, kalpi, sinki etc. have a long history in human nutrition from ancient ages for lactic acid fermentation. Lactic acid is used in foodstuffs for acidification to increase flavor and aroma and is a potent microbial inhibitor. Lactic acid is applied to a diverse range of foodstuffs including meats, fish, vegetables, cereals and cake products. In fermented drinks, it is used to contribute specifically to aroma and preservation. The chemical formula is C3H6O3. The structure of D-lactic acid is shown below. The lactic acid exists naturally in two optical isomers, D-lactic acid and L-plus lactic acid, of which L-plus is preferred in food applications. Elevated levels of the D isomer are harmful to humans. The inhibitory activity of lactic acid is also stereospecific. L-lactic acid is much more inhibitory for E. coli strains than for the D-isomer, whereas L-monocytogenes is most sensitive to D-lactic acid. Lactic acid penetration across the cell membrane appears to be similar for the two isomers. Bacterial strains are least sensitive to the isomer that they intrinsically produce. This implies an additional resistance mechanism, either an enzymatic reaction or a stereospecific efflux system. Lactic acid can be produced commercially by either chemical synthesis or fermentation. The chemical synthesis results in a racemic mixture of the two isomers, whereas during fermentation, an optically pure form of lactic acid is produced. However, this may depend on the microorganisms, fermentation substrates and fermentation conditions. Sodium lactate is the sodium salt of natural lactic acid, that's L+, and is a normal component of muscle tissue. It is primarily used in meat products to extend cold storage and the effects are more bacteriostatic than bactericidal. The spectrum of activity of sodium lactate is actually quite narrow and may even be specific for a certain group of organisms. 
Lactic acid is the major LAB metabolite causing pH reductions that inhibit many microorganisms. However, both acetic and propionic acids have higher pKa values than the lactic acid and therefore have a higher proportion of undissociated acid at a certain pH. Now let's see about the sorbic acid. It is a weak organic acid and, it's, and this antimicrobial agent again has GRA status. Together with the organic acids, benzoic acid and acetic acid, sorbic acids are the most commonly used chemical preservatives of food. Sorbic acid is preferred to other organic acids because of its physiological harmlessness and organoleptic neutrality. Sorbic acid is a 6-carbon monocarboxylic acid, unsaturated at positions 2 and 4, known to be a membrane-active compound. The chemical formula is C6H8O2 and the structure of sorbic acid is shown in the figure. Sorbic acid and its salts have several advantages as food preservatives without altering taste or order of food. They are highly active against fungi as well as a wide range of bacteria. However, potassium salt is more commonly used because of its stable nature. Potassium sorbate is also much more soluble and very suitable for use in dipping and spraying decontamination practices. However, sorbates have many uses because of their milder taste, greater defectiveness and broader pH range, even up to 6.5 when compared to either benzoate or propionate. Solubility is 58.2% at 20 degrees centigrade. Next, let us see about ascorbic acid. Ascorbic acid and its various derivatives have GRA status and are common preservatives in the production of canned foods. And this uh, salts are the leading antioxidants used on fruits and vegetables in fruit juices. It also acts as an oxygen scavenger by removing molecular oxygen in polyphenol oxidation reactions. The structure of ascorbic acid is shown in the diagram. Chemical formula is C6H8O6. Next, let us see about benzoic acid. Benzoic acid is one of the oldest and most commonly used chemical preservatives possessing GRAS status. However, the use of sodium benzoate as a food preservative has been optimal in products that are acidic in nature, specifically suitable for foods and beverages with pH less than 4.5. Benzoic acid with sorbic acid is particularly popular in confectionery. It has been detected as a natural constituent of cranberries, raspberries, plums, prunes, cinnamon and cloves. In other applications, benzoic acid has also been used as a mild antiseptic in cough medicines, mouthwashes, toothpaste and as an antifungal in ointments. Adverse effects of sodium benzoate have been reported to be hyperactivity and asthma. The chemical formula of benzoic acid is C7H6O2 and the diagram shows the structure of benzoic acid. Let us see about the cinnamic acid. It is a phenolic component of several spices including cinnamon referred as GRAS and used as a component in several food flavoring. The chemical formula is C9H8O2. The structure of cinnamic acid is shown here. It consists of a relatively large family of organic acid isomers extracted from plants or chemically synthesized. Although high concentrations of cinnamic acid have been reported to cause browning in some fruits, it has been found to be very effective in prolonging shelf life of several important fruit products such as fresh tomato slices which are stored at 4 degree or 25 degree centigrade. The phenolic nature of cinnamic acid gives the oil cinnamon its characteristic order and flavor. It is soluble in water or ethanol and in nature cinnamic acid derivatives are known to be important metabolic building blocks in the production of lignans for higher plants. It is classified as a skin, eye and respiratory tract irritant. Now let us see about formic acid which is the shortest chain organic acid making it diffuse into a microbial cell and to accumulate very quickly at the expense of the microbial membrane pH causing acidification of the cytoplasm. It is used as a preservative in livestock feed. As such, it is sprayed on fresh hay or other silage to arrest the decaying processes and may also cause the feed to retain its nutritive value longer. It is therefore widely used in the preservation of winter feed for cattle. Let us see about gluconic acid. It, gluconic acid and its derivatives are widely applied in the food and pharmaceutical industries. Gluconic acid is a mild organic acid derived from glucose facilitated by the enzyme glucose oxidase in fungi and glucose dehydrogenase in bacteria. Microbial production of gluconic acid dates back several decades and has been uh, preferred the method for production. Aspergillus niger is frequently used in the fermentation process. 
It is popular for causing a refreshing sour taste in various foodstuffs including wine and fruit juices and is used for prevention of milkstone in the dairy industry. The derivative gluconodelta-lactone functions as a slow-acting acidulant in processing meat such as sausage whereas sodium gluconate is known to be highly overpowering. The chemical formula is C6H12O7. The structure of D-gluconic acid is given in the figure. Now let's see about tartaric acid. Tartaric acid is also one of the hydroxy acids it is naturally present in fruits such as pineapples and grapes and is consequently also the major acid in wine and wine vinegars. Primarily due to its low pKa values, tartaric acid is often used as an acidulant. The tartness profile of tartaric acid is smoother than that of the citric acid and it has a higher peak acid taste than the citric acid and is no longer lasting and is self uh, longer lasting. Tartaric acid is also the most expensive among the acids commonly used in food. The chemical formula is C4H6O6. The structure of tartaric acid is given in the figure. Now let's have a look at the other types of acids. That's phenyl lactic acid is another organic acid with an interesting potential for application as an antimicrobial agent in food. It has a broad spectrum of inhibition specifically against a variety of foodborne fungi. Concentrations required for antifungal activity, particularly against moles from bakery products, are generally lower than concentrations required against bacterial food contaminants. Phenyl lactic solutions or orderless gallic acid, which is also called as 345 trihydroxybenzoic acid, is a natural plant phenol. It's an organic acid found in walnuts, sumac, which has tea leaves, oak bark, and other plants. Gallic acid has been found to possess antifungal and antiviral properties and derivatives such as propyl gallate, octyl gallate, laurel gallate and dodecyl gallate are also widely used as food additives in reducing rancidity and as preservatives. Let us see some of the food products naturally containing organic acids. Organic acids occur naturally in many foods as a result of metabolic processes, hydrolysis or bacterial growth. Alternatively, they can be added directly to food as acidulants or flavorants. The table lists the organic acids which are naturally found in foodstuffs. So to conclude, the organic acids are typical products of cell metabolism. Organic acids are important to biological processes since they are involved in various fundamental pathways in plant and animal metabolism and catabolism as intermediate or final products. The commonly used organic acids are citric acid, lactic acid, acetic acid, sorbic acid, ascorbic acid, benzoic acid, cinnamic acid, formic acid, gluconic acid, malic acid, tartaric acid and so on. Now we have got an idea about the nature and composition of organic acids.